Hey guys, Sawyer at Sawyer's Lawn Care Service here. Uh, today is Leaf Box Day. We're going to be putting together the Leaf Box and redesigning it. Uh, we have quite a few changes this year um, from last year. Our Leaf Box was already pretty large and we had the Billy Goat Debris Loader, the 18 horsepower on here. But now we have this guy on here. We just upgraded to the big boy. Billy Goat, the 37 horsepower engine, 14 inch intake but it's gonna sit way higher. So we gotta design a tarp top canopy. We're going to use uh, one of the frame, one of the old frames I have of that canopy over there. Now we're gonna cut it up and just basically extend the leaf box. Uh, we are gonna try to keep it, you know, pretty low, like pretty far below the maximum allowance of in our area. So, I mean, I think the, the max allowance is around like 12 and a half feet. We're gonna try to keep it 12 feet or under. Right now it's well under that. Um, this thing was super fun to put on. We uh, we ended up using the vent track with some forks. Uh, we were doing it at the end of a work day, so I didn't really have any time to pull out a camera. Didn't have mommy, but uh, that would have been an interesting video. Maybe we'll film it when we take it back off. Um, there's probably a, I would prefer using like a gantry crane or something to get it on there. Cause that sucker is heavy, but it's just so we didn't have it at the time. Um, without anything on it right now. It should weigh under 480 pounds. The tractor, it was able to handle it with the forks. It was a little sketchy, but it worked. So yeah, we're gonna get into it. So we're gonna put the old leaf box on and then we're gonna extend it even higher and work on getting this new debris loader set up. Oh, and on a side note, uh, the other vehicle, the SUV where I keep the tripods, is currently in the shop getting the hubs replaced or one of the hubs replaced, the wheel bearing, I'm sorry, the wheel bearing on the hub uh, broke the other day. My tripod's in there, so we're gonna use tiny tripods. Um, and just kind of get a little imaginative with the uh, angles here so we can keep filming even without having our large tripods. So yeah, now let's get into it. We've now cut a hole in the box here. We're gonna see if it's good. Oh, is it? How are, how are we doing back there, Jason? Is there stuff any, anything back there in the way? Uh, what do you mean? Just to lift up high enough? Is anything gonna roll chaotically? Okay. So effectively, cut the slot there, and hopefully, it just goes all the way past that bottom wall, or we're gonna have some issues. <laughs> Yeah, let's go ahead and grab all the random miscellaneous stuff out. Help if I pressed up. Okay, that's good. Where's the exact point there? Right there? Yeah.
dolly.
on day two of the project here. Um, we were just going to do that frame, but we figured it was going to bow out on top of the mesh. So we're actually going to put uh, half inch plywood walls up there, up on top. Uh, we got to work on the front here. We've got to make a hinge door for this thing to come out on. Uh, rebuild the entire front here. We got the hose on. Hello. Hello. Uh, we're going to use more stake pockets to build a third tier up top here. Um, that's going to attach to the plywood. We're going to put some 4x4s here to move the door way up in the air. And it's going to sit behind this current door. And then we're going to put the ply, another plywood wall here. So it should all be able to come down in three tiers. Um, and then for the metal framing inside, we are going to use U-bolts. And get that secured to the wall and then put a mesh tarp over top. So I'm excited to see how it turns out. marking some uh, boards we're gonna do there are new pillars on the back we got the whole metal frame attached with all the u-bolts nice and solid now we just gotta put the plywood up on top here our two brand new pillars to hold the giant door <coughs> gotta cut that sucker with a chainsaw this is a child safe program yes <laughs> Sir, sir, I can talk to you about, our, about your car's extended warranty. I'm so done. No comment. With no. this now. Doubt, just look straight in their eyes and go, I agree. I concur. Yeah, easily. Okay. This piece fell off earlier. Carry on. 